Hello, Bogdaniers. We are at the International Printing Museum for the Independence Day celebration. Opened in 1988, this museum brings the history of books, printing, and the book arts to life. First, we're getting a stamp in our Passport to History booklet for our visit. Today, we'll be celebrating our country's birthday with the founding fathers, John Adams, Thomas Jefferson, and Benjamin Franklin. The day's festivities include special working tour of the museum collection. And this little press here we have, uh, it's called a proofing press. So you know when you're doing your homework and you want to make sure that everything is right, you go back and check it? Uh, this is uh, the type of press you would use to check your work. What we're going to do here, uh, you see all this black ink here? We're going to take a little bit of it, kind of roll it around, and roll it across our letters. Put it down here. Okay, you want to grab the handle and we'll roll it across. Roll it across. Perfect. There are many hands-on exhibits like this where we get to keep what we print. This press was invented by a Baptist minister in the late 1790s. He wanted to print a church newspaper and he couldn't afford to buy a press, so he invented his own press. And here is the first edition of the LA Times. Next, a man is demonstrating the Java press with the type set in a chase. Now Brother is making his own print. eating lunch, which is included with the event. We're having Freedom Dogs and American Apple Pie. Then there was some music and dancing. <laughs> and my dad even joined in. We're back to looking at the printing presses. The man is rolling on the ink. Placing the paper, and I'm helping him turn the wheel. Da, 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 da. It's a copy of the Declaration. Then this man is teaching us the history of the document. This says a declaration. This says a unanimous declaration. Very important. Now he's showing us how to make the type. And it, that is, hit it with a hammer. Creates a mold. It's liquid. And it becomes hard. Once I have that letter, I can cast multiples of it. So I'm going to knock this tail off, file it down. Now all my letters are going to stand exactly the same height. 0.918 of an inch. Next, we're learning about the most famous printer. This is the Gutenberg Press. Then he got interrupted. Hear ye, hear ye, now hear this. The house is open for the confounding brothers in our theater. First come, first serve seating. The man continues. Before we ink it up, I'm going to show you these. These are called ink balls. So what you would do is dip them in ink. I am helping him with the demonstration. Then it happened again. Hear ye, hear ye, now hear this. We better hurry it up so we can see the show. Ta-da! Here's our print. Lastly, we're watching The Confounding Brothers, a humorous and thought-provoking account of the creation of the Declaration of Independence and how our nation came to be. Well, if there's one thing I've learned in my illustrious career is uh, never to argue with a lawyer. <laughs> Especially when you have two of them in the same room. <laughs> we had so much fun at the International Printing Museum. Please hit the subscribe button and remember to look for your own adventure.